hey guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel today is a beautiful when it's tuesday morning yeah and i have a couple of things to do today so i want to carry you guys along see i discovered that when i write the things i want to do like when i write my to-do list in a day it really helps me achieve those things because i like to like you know tick off the things that i have done on the list you understand you you get what i mean i don't know if i'm the only one that it happens to like if i wake up in a day and i don't have things lined up for me to do and i consciously write them down maybe that day i'll just be so distract i mean i'll just lazy about be so distracted and end up maybe not achieving anything like yesterday <laughs> yesterday that was holiday <laughs> I did not go out. I did not go out. I did not go anywhere. And I did not even achieve anything. Did I achieve anything? No, I did not achieve anything. So today morning, as I woke up, after praying, I wrote my to-do list and pasted it on the wall. You know, so um I'm in the kitchen, as you can see, and I'm cooking. I'm cooking beans. I love beans. Am I the only one? If you like beans like me, please comment. Leave it in the comment section. <laughs> Ah, so um after cooking now i'll feed my baby then i'll film two videos the first one i want to film is how we moved from nigeria to the uk so i'm gonna tell it's gonna be like a story time so i'm gonna just you guys the whole process everything that happened from beginning till now because as you guys know that as you guys know i lost all the videos so I'm just gonna be just seeing I, I I don't even want to remember it because where well, oh god god see <clears throat> I've had my own fair share of challenges in this life. Ah 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 there were some times say eh, God in the midst of challenges I'll be feeling like I cannot survive this <laughs> but then God finds a way to give me strength, you know, to help me go through all those <coughs> challenging times <coughs> excuse me you know and then one one um how do i put it one method okay that i usually use to overcome challenges is to look just when i'm in the midst of difficult situations when i i mean i feel like i'm gonna collapse you know so i just look beyond the present and look at the result you know i just focus on the result i just focus on when that phase has passed you, you get what i mean yes i'll just focus at the end that's where i put my focus and then just go through the stuff and then get to the end of it you know so when i'm going through um <coughs> youtube now i see some people's vlogs relocation vlog ah I mean, I just I just scroll past it because I don't even want to remember the videos I lost. But through it all, I am grateful to God. I am very grateful to God. Like, I have every reason to be thankful. Like, I have every reason to be grateful to God. You know, God has been so good to me and my family. God has been... God has been a father. He has been a friend. He has been amazing. And... Let me focus on the good good things that God has done for us. So, um, after I had the second video I want to film is um, how much it cost us to relocate as a family of three. Okay, so that it can, um, it's going to be an evergreen information, you know, so I, people can use it to estimate how much it will cost them to move to the UK on a student visa. Okay, so yeah i'm just gonna put out the information out there so it can help people okay i'm gonna document it you know for documentation purposes and for helping people you know so that they can plan know how to plan themselves and all you don't have to have the entire money to start the process trust me you don't have to have the entire money but just start you know just have a plan trust god and start start first you know there, there will always be a way don't worry 
even the even God said in Isaiah 43, like when you are between the rock and the blue sea, like when you are when you are stuck, I'm gonna pull you through. You're not gonna you're not gonna it's not gonna swallow you. You understand what I mean? Uh -huh. So um I, I don't have a tripod yet. I don't have a tripod, so I need to save up money to buy a good tripod. Yeah, so I, I don't think I'll be able to like show you guys like position my phone well so it will capture the whole cooking process you no know? um but i'm gonna show you guys what i'm cooking as usual so um when i finish filming those two videos i'll have to call up agents there are some numbers we're still looking for accommodation <laughs> i'm still looking for accommodation so i need to call up some numbers you know they didn't work yesterday and they don't work weekends so i need to call up some numbers and then what else i'll go to school i'll go to school by 4 p.m welcome week starts today yeah so I'm go i'll go to school by 4 p.m and do you even know they gave us timetable of the events we have throughout this week and do you <laughs> do you know you have to even book tickets for them you have to book tickets so i even checked i even checked um um the event we have by 2 p.m today i think 2 30 p.m today i checked it is fully booked so i'm not I'm not um, going for that one, but I now booked for the one of 4 p.m. So, yeah, I think I'm going to go for that one. Yes. Yeah. So, let me show you guys. Yeah, I think that's what I have for today. That's what I have for today. So, baby is going out. So, I'm going to stay at home with Emmanuel. And I'm praying to God that this boy will not disturb my life because this boy, God. Anyway. I thank God. So let me show you guys what I'm cooking quick and then I'll go and bait. I just baited the manual so that I'll go and bait. After baiting, I'll come back and continue cooking. Yeah, I'll come back and continue cooking. Yeah, just like that. If I continue, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please like this video, okay? Okay, okay. This is my palm oil. Palm oil, yeah. This is my fresh tomatoes and this is my onions this is my crayfish this is my salt this is pepper this is my seasoning cubes this is my ginger and this is my garlic do you guys use ginger and garlic to cook to cook beans if you don't please try it is a game changer game changer and this is my beans cooking so i'll just go and bit right now I just got baits. I just got baits. Yep. So I'll see you guys later. Okay, guys. Our food is ready. Sure, you can see it very well. <laughs> our beans is ready. Ah, this camera is not. It's not. It's not doing justice to the beauty of this food. <laughs> All right, and my mother is here, so I want to just feed him. <laughs> Somebody is hungry. <laughs> mm. And I like the way it's dissolved. Like it's very soft. So it'd be very easy for my boy. Somebody is very hungry. <laughs> Please, if you understand what Emmanuel is talking about, leave it in the comment section. <laughs> <laughs> I love the taste of 
ginger and garlic inside beans inside food in fact inside any food <laughs> so nice Come and eat, please come and eat. <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> see, God, God is good. See, eh? let me tell you, this accommodation looking for this accommodation is stressing me out. It's stressing me out, but like, there are things that God is doing for me and my family that is he's, he's giving me hope. He's giving, like, He's just telling me, I am with you, just calm down. I'm with you, just calm down. You understand. You know, my pastor, in fact, our landlord here in this temporary accommodation gave us the number of a pastor. We called him, so we went to church on Sunday, this Sunday that just passed now. So, on Tuesday, he called us again, you know, to check how we are doing and all. So, I told him there are things I needed, okay? Um, I gave them a list of the things I needed. He said, okay, he's going to post it on the church group to see if we can get from people. So, yesterday, um... His wife called me and said uh, that he saw the list of things that we needed, that she will stop by my house, this place, today to give me some of the things that she can give me then. The remaining we can get from church. My God, my God. <laughs> I'm so excited. Like, I am excited. Like, I've been calling agents since today, you know. So this, this things now that she brought for me is just giving me joy in my spirit like i'm so excited i'm grateful to god i am grateful to god i know that we'll sort out this accommodation asap like like in no time we're gonna sort it out but meanwhile i want to show you guys what she brought which i am really really excited about first of all i didn't buy winter jackets in nigeria okay i bought some jackets but i don't think they are gonna be enough for the kind of cold <laughs> To handle the cold I've been hearing about. Manuel, please allow me. Thank you. So she got me a winter jacket. <laughs> oh, this is nice. This is nice. I'm so excited. Anyway, she said she 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 got it. She got it for herself. She hasn't really worn it that much. Oh uh, oh Hey, I'm so excited. Oh boy, and he's like, he's way down on my knee, he's just on my knee. Hey, God, I'm so, I'm so, <laughs> so I was asking her <clears throat> whether this song will be able to hold me as they protect me from the cold I'm hearing about in this country. She said, Yes, yeah, so uh, there's something so sad. This obviously happened. So, <laughs> What is this? I mean, I am excited. I am excited. I now we wear sweater. She now said I wear sweater inside. Then wear this one on top of it. Hey, hey. Oh, my God. And this is my size. I don't need to like. This is perfect. Perfect. Then I, she got duvet for us. Hey, Jesus. I am. I am beyond excited. I am excited. Hey, and I'm grateful to God. You got to do it for us. This, I mean, <clears throat> this is the the duvet cover or set. I don't know, but I think it's easy to wrap up this one. Yeah. She got a new blender for us. He God, God knows how much I want to start blending. Um, smoothies, God of mercy. Hey. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Ah, I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. What did she bring? She got biscuits for us. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> oh my God, I don't know if you can feel my excitement, but I am 
exciting and i'm super grateful to god okay all right i'll see you guys later <laughs> Also, I wanted to share with you guys that our landlord just brought in um, this meal. Yeah, this meal for us. So that's our NIN actually. So I've even opened, <laughs> I've opened baby's own already. So yeah, this is it. I, I think they said it comes in a card before, but now they are giving paper. So mm -hmm. we applied for it uh, last week. Last week Monday. So today is today is Thursday. Yeah. So they said your national insurance number is yours. No one can use it. It will not change. It's not a proof of your identity. So I'm really glad that we have gotten this one because most of the jobs we are getting will be asking for national insurance number. So I'm glad we have gotten this one. This one is sorted out. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Like, I know that God is with us and he's going to plant us. He's going to plant us. Keep us rooted in this land or somewhere else better. <laughs> All right.